the most important part of any successful PK unit is to have five men on the same page knowing what you're willing to give up and that includes your goaltender. You've got four penalty killers against five guys in a power play who have to work very closely with their goaltender. Everyone has to be on the same page. They've got to know what the opposition is going to be trying to do as their one or two set plays and be willing to stop, be ready to stop those as well as what we're willing to give up if they make those plays so that your goalie becomes part of that unit and now it becomes a five on five. Coach once said that hard work and intelligence is the key to it. Well, you've got to have a unit that's cohesive, so that you have to be on the same page. And yes, you have to work hard. It's all about stops and starts. It's all about getting in the right shooting lanes. And there's an awful lot of hockey sense involved. You've got to be able to make adjustments on the ice that a coach can't make for you. Because there's so many broken plays in the game that a guy with hockey sense can make the adjustments naturally. A guy without hockey sense starts chasing the puck, which makes it easier for the power of play. So hockey sense is a huge part. Courage to get in the shooting lanes and, and the willingness and the hard work of stopping and starting. And how do you measure whether the big play is being successful or not? Well, it all, all depends on, again, what you're willing to give up. It also depends on the caliber of the power play you're going against. If you're going against a top-level power play, then you're, you know, if you can give up, if you can hold them to one chance per power play, then you're doing a good job. If you're playing against a lower-end power play that doesn't move the puck very well and, and, and obviously is not as well organized as other units, then you shouldn't be giving up any units or any chances if, you're, if your penalty killers are on the same page and are a co uh, cohesive, hard-working unit.